everyone in this video we'll be discussing very interesting and important technique that is like how to calculate non perfect square roots i will be discussing an important and easy way of calculating non perfect square root in just 2 seconds of time that is like many of us know how to calculate square root of perfect numbers but many of us does not know how to square root of imperfect numbers saying like square root of 10 what is square root of 12 what is square root of 13 many of us does not have a proper idea but solving this is like really simple in this session we'll be discussing how to calculate square root of imperfect numbers in just two seconds of time let us calculate square root of 12 if i need to calculate square root of 12 it's just really simple just what you need to know is like perfect square closer to 12 perfect square closer to 12 will be 9 or perfect square closer to 12 it will be 16 as well now write this in terms of 9 or write this in terms of 16 as of your wish any of them will give us the same answer i will show you both of this let us example if i write this in terms of 9 if i write this in terms of 9 this will be 9 plus 3 which means 12 can be written as 9 plus 3 or you can write this in terms of 16 as well if you are writing it in terms of 16 this will be 16 minus 4 16 minus minus 4 again will be 12 it is just like two simple steps it's like just two seconds of time concentrate here now i have written it is 9 plus 3 now what you will do is like what is square root of 9 square root of 9 is like 3 so write that 3 so write 3 and write the same sign whatever you have as you have positive sign write positive sign as this is plus write this as plus now this is more how much more three more as it is three more write that three divided by double of this value double of this value what is double of three double of three will be six when you simplify this one this will be 0 0.5 which means value is going to be 3.5 approximately which means square root of 12 will be 3.5 if necessary you can open your calculators you will be getting the same answers okay now let us calculate this one even calculating this one is like simple now if you look here what is square root of 16 square root of 16 will be 4 so write that 4 as it is minus write the same minus sign whatever the sign you have you need to write the same sign as it is less how much less 4 less so write that 4 divide by double of this number double of 4 what is double of 4 8 now 4 by 8 will be 0 0.5 when you simplify this one will come to know the value is going to be 3.5 whether you do this calculation or whether you do this calculation both of them will be same answers the only simple thing is like you need to split them in terms of perfect square closer to that whether it is more or less it's not a problem if it is like more you'll be taking it as a positive sign if it is less you'll be taking it as a negative sign so simply what you'll do is like you'll write the perfect square value plus whatever you have more whatever you have less you'll be writing it divided by double of this value double of this once you simplify this one you can calculate square root of any imperfect square numbers okay let us calculate square root of 10 square root of 10 simple write this if i write this in terms of 9 so this will be 9 plus 1 now what is square root of 9 square root of 9 will be 3 as it is plus write the same plus sign it is more how much more means one more one divided by double of three double of three will be six now when you simplify this one this will be 3.166 which means square root of 10 will be 3.166 if necessary you can open the calculators you'll be getting the same answers it's just like simple thing so you can calculate them and you can calculate square root of any imperfect square number okay let us calculate square root of 28 square root of 28 now write this square root of 28 in terms of 25 now this will be 25 plus 3 now what is square root of 25 25 square root will be 5 so write 5 as it is plus write the same plus sign plus now it is more by 3 so 3 divided by double of 5 double of 5 will be 10 which means value for this will be 5.3 which means square root of 28 will be 5.3 these are like exact answers if necessary you can open your calculators and you can calculate the value will be like 5.3 exactly so all this is like really simple just what you need to do is like follow the same procedure if you follow this procedure it's just like two seconds of time and you can calculate square root of any imperfect square numbers let us calculate square root of 32 now square root of 32 i will write in terms of 36 if i write in terms of 36 it will be 36 minus 4 if i write it as 36 minus 4 what is square root of 36 square root of 36 will be 6 as it is minus write minus it is 4 so write 4 and double of 6 what is double of 6 double of 6 will be 12 now this will be like 
1 by 3, 1 by 3 means it will be 0 0.33, so value will be 5.66, which means square root of 32 will be 5.66. It's like simple thing. If necessary, you can calculate in your calculators as well. They will be showing us the same answers. Okay, let us look at one more example. Square root of 93. Now, let us write this 93 in terms of 100. If I write in terms of 100, this will be 100 minus 7. Now, you know anyway square root of 100. Square root of 100 will be 10. Okay. As it is minus, write the same minus. Now, write this 7. Write this 7. Divide by double of 10. Double of 10 will be 20. Double of 10 will be 20. Now, if you simplify this one, this is 7 by 20. If you multiply this with 5, then what happened? This will change to 100. So, this will change to 35. 35 divided by 100 will be 0.35. So, 10 minus 0.35. This will be 9.65, which means value will be 9.65 these are like simple calculations the only thing you need to do is like when you practice more number of examples you can solve these questions easily let us calculate square root of 648 square root of 648 now if i calculate this one write this in terms of 625 now this will be 625 plus it is 23 more so plus 23 square root of 625 square root of 625 will be 25 plus it is more how much more 23 more so 23 divided by 25 double 25 double will be 50 when you simplify this one this will be 25.46 so square root of 648 will be 25.46 if necessary you can open your calculators and you can calculate all whatever you're solving you'll be getting exact answers simple technique hope you guys have enjoyed this session if you think that this session is helpful for you and if you need more of such interesting and smart logics then please subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon as well so that you'll be getting the notification once the video is uploaded and i need all you guys to share this video with your friends your family members your facebook groups and your whatsapp groups so that we'll be getting a real boost up and good innovative thoughts in the next upcoming videos until then have a nice day meet in the next session <laughs>